Welcome everyone in a new episode of the Immortal Chess Games series. Today we are going to watch a beautiful game from the classical chess era, played by Emanuel Lasker, who was a German chess player, mathematician and philosopher, who was world chess champion for 27 years the longest reign of any officially recognized world chess champion in history. In his prime, Lasker was one of the most dominant champions and he is still generally regarded as one of the strongest players in history. And Harry Nelson Pillsbury was a leading American chess player. At the age of 22, he won one of the strongest tournaments of the time, the Hastings 1895 chess tournament. But his illness and early death prevented him from challenging for the World Chess Championship in St. Petersburg 1895. D4, D5, C4, E6, Queen's Gambit declined. Knight c3, knight f6, knight f3, c5, semi charash variation, bishop g5, c takes d4, queen takes d4, primitive Pillsbury variation, knight c6, queen h4, bishop e7, long castling, queen a5, e3, bishop d7. King b1, h6, c takes d5, e takes d5, knight d4, castling. Bishop takes f6, bishop takes f6, queen h5, knight takes d4, e takes d4, bishop e6, f4, rook a, c8 f5 rook takes c3 it is a typical sacrifice in the opposite castling positions as lasker attempts to weaken the white king by getting right of the defending knight and opening the b file on the king f takes e6 black prefer to take the light squares bishop now pause the video and try to find the Lasker's move. Rook a3. Lasker treats to take the a pawn and answers to opening the b file. E takes f7 check. Rook takes f7. B takes a3. Queen b6 check. Bishop b5. Queen takes b5 check. King a1, rook c7, rook d2, rook c4, rook h d1, rook c3, queen f5, queen c4, king b2. Pause the video again and try to find what Lasker can do. Rook takes a3. Magnificent move, and now the ending is coming. Queen e6 check, king h7, king takes a3, queen c3 check, king a4, b5 check, king takes b5, queen c4 check, king a5, bishop d8 check, queen b6, bishop b6, checkmate, black queens. This was one of the masterpieces of the classical chess era, in which the understanding of chess developed, especially from the strategic side, thanks to the founder of chess theory, the first world chess champion, William Steinitz, and thanks to Emmanuel Lasker, the second world chess champion who studied and later developed Steinitz's ideas and who gave us this beautiful game. Thank you everyone for watching, subscribe and like if the video was helpful. Goodbye everyone.